How's it going, everybody? It's the boy Po, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to get the out of all the depth here in Operation. So, let's get into it. Okay, guys, and this cave is a really hidden one, but it's super easy, and the only thing that you're gonna need is gonna be either a shotgun and a sword or a Jin Link. Now, you can also use Ravagers, you can use Pyro Mains, but if you're gonna be using one of those, you're gonna need zip lines. So that's why I'm gonna be using a Jin Link, which is extremely easy. I can fly around and don't have to worry about none of that. Now the entrance of the cave is going to be exactly at 48.427 and the other map where some people have different coordinates going to be right here the joystick drift lets me. So it's 48.3 26.9. Yep, yeah, you have it. For landmarks, we are outside of portals behind the little island in the lake. That's portals right there. Come out. That's the island behind the island. So yeah, and the G Link is nothing special. It was a 130 that I tamed. Put some levels into health, some stamina, and melee. And we're using a primitive saddle. That's how easy this cave is gonna be. So we're gonna go inside. Now you have to be careful because down on the water there's gonna be crabs. Par uh, I'm gonna say pyromains. They're gonna be ravagers, and there's gonna be a lot of dangerous stuff that can kill you really quick. So you want to try to prevent getting out of the path and go straight to the artifact, get it, and then just leave. Now inside you can find gold tails. You don't have to go all the way to the rock drakes card to find them. But again, it's a really dangerous spot, so I don't know if you really want to come over here to just get glow tails. Let's see. So we are in the main chamber. We're gonna go right. Come out of the plural, just fall down. Yeah, basically where the Atopura is. I, mean, I think I can just glide over it. Yep, perfect. Oh, you don't want that. Yep, exactly what you don't want is what I did. Okay, so apparently this time there's not going to be many crabs, but you have eels. And over here. Yep, there we go. Yep, fly up, fly up, fly away from the crab. I'm telling you, I still don't have like the full control of this thing. Now, if you fall down, you can go through that pathway it leads up to where we want to go but yeah okay so we are up let's try this again and apparently there's an explorer node right there but right now for me the servers are extremely laggy so you have to be careful with that uh, hopefully when you're trying this it's gonna be fixed so as you can see people have zip lines because they can do they can go with the characters or they can use the Ravager. But, you know, we are different. We use Jin Links. Wait, was that right? Oh, I thought that was uh, the glow of a, of a drop. So just use the Jin Link, fly over here. Let's sit down. Seeker, don't be annoying, please. Okay, let's sit down there. So there's a crab right down there. There's a the Plurus. I think there was a cave, I think, where the crab is standing that they have scorched earth traps and you can get some interesting things especially for the boss but the Jin Link cannot defeat a crab so they can barely defeat a seeker come on die can you die already? because I don't want to come back and have you annoy me thank you so yeah you're gonna have to come with something decently strong to be able to kill that or be able to be quick enough to go to that cave, get the stuff, and then head head out. These are the glow tails that I was mentioning before. They have a lot of babies and stuff. You can also get them by the rock drakes trench or scar, whatever you want to call it. But over there, they're a little bit more rare. Easier to get compared to coming to this cave. Uh, wait. If I'm not mistaken, it was right. Nope, it was left. Okay, and I said back. So yeah, it was left. Going down. Keep going down. Hopefully there's no ravagers or nothing. Sometimes there's ravagers around this pass. But since people run this so often, normally they're like away from it. They like kite them away. See, there's another... Glowtail, Seeker, more crabs. Oh, don't push me. 
you annoying thing. And I'm gonna kill it just to make our life easier later. I'm definitely gonna come back and see the drops if we can find any, because right now everybody's like farming them non-stop. The drops uh, on this case are actually pretty good, so. But also, as you can see, zip lines to the little thing, but if not, you just walk over here. Over here you can find scorpions, you can find cardinals. So a decent dino can work, but you have to be really careful, like I said. And yes, I know I say it a lot, but you do have to be careful. Sometimes you get overconfidence, like, oh, it's just a cardinal, just a scorpion, and out of nowhere, like, boop, you're dead. Okay. That's that cardinal there, there's another glow tail on the bush. Can I pass without... No, the yeah, aggro. Okay. Can I push you? Ah, oh, you're a level 5. I can kill you pretty quick. Or oh, fall down. Fall down. Thank you. Bye. Okay, so we don't have anything else that I see. Nope. We can get the drop. Ooh, don't fall down. Grab it. Let's see. Artifact of the depth. Nice. And just like that, we can just get the same pass and get out. So yeah, guys, it's that simple. Now, like I said before, everybody's farming this cave, so I don't know where the drops are. It's going to take a little bit. So yeah, that's going to be everything for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it, found it useful. And if you do, remember, leave a like, subscribe for more future videos. Any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.